the police are very busy. They're looking also for a man charged with shooting and killing a boy at a south side bus stop. Bill Niston spoke with the boy's family as they look for closure, change, and justice. The bus stop at 16th and Forest Homes become a memorial for Nelson Manuel Lopez Correa. He was humble, he was respectful. His family is still at a loss. Fox 6 isn't identifying his mother out of concerns for her safety. With the support of my family, I'm, I'm hanging out strong for my son and just doing what we have to do to find the person responsible for this. Back on October 28th, the 15-year-old was waiting to catch a bus to school along with two other friends. It was around 11 a.m. That's when prosecutors say 18-year-old Christian Martin, upset over a breakup this past summer with a girl, shot Lopez Correa in the head. He was rushed to Children's Hospital but never regained consciousness. He died three days later. I promised my son we'd get justice for him. From the start, police say they had a suspect. Martin's been on the run since. On Friday, prosecutors charged him with first-degree intentional homicide. It gives me hope, but I'd feel better once they got him, because he shouldn't be running these streets. Police ask if you know something to give them a call. Back here at 16th and Forest Home, that's where Lopez Correa's family tells me that they plan to rally this weekend, calling for stricter gun laws and action from elected leaders. In Milwaukee, Bill Miston. Fox 6 News.